Sana ganun yung mangyari and ma-adapt natin sa country. More open communication between parents and their kids when it comes to sex. Para sa akin po, we had our workshops, our face-to-face -face workshops, and that really allowed a chance for us all to get to know each other and understand our characters better. We did the whole activity na magsusulat kami our, um, our driving force in our lives and kung anong goal namin and all these things to fully understand the character through and through. And yun nga po, the workshop really allowed us a chance to talk and have fun and get to know each other. So pagdating dun sa shoot it was very fun and calm and everyone got the job done of course you're gonna get to know the characters even more witness their story and of course the finale to the series um all those things a lot of more sexy scenes that everyone's waiting for it's just all of it together um comedy sex life as an actor, I always think there are improvements to make and I always try to watch every, I mean, I watch every film I do and I try to see how I can improve and in which areas I need to pick up on. Isa po doon yung pagtagalog ko, kailangan ko talagang mag-practice. Um, but of course, I'm proud of the outcome and I'm proud of what we've created together. I'm still really happy with it and yeah. Para sa akin naman po, kasi in high school and grade school actually, I already went through sex education and we were taught all the scientific sides of a penis and a vagina and reproduction and all these things but i think this conversation needs to continue at home with your parents with your friends who you trust um kasi dun talaga ma in depth film conversation where you can ask anything without well supposedly without feeling scared to ask and sana ganun yung mangyari and ma-adapt natin sa country more open communication between parents and their kids when it comes to sex um, and yeah, I think that's starting now, especially with things like this, Sana it helps. Uh, for the condoms naman po, I think they should be in schools, but that's just personally. Kasi po, I, I witnessed kids in my school having sex on campus, and I know it happens. So para sa akin, at least they have the resources to do it safely and not spread diseases if they do decide to partake in intercourse. So, Kat, are you in favor of putting condoms or placing condoms uh, as a school? Of course. But that's just me. Um, syempre naman po, I mean, I love what I do. I love meeting people and trying new things. So, it's always a yes for me. Yung production team and the cast and direct and everyone just waking up in the morning and seeing them and yun, I miss that. Pero tama naman po sinabi ni Angela, we'll always have other opportunities to work with each other and see each other in this industry. So I just look forward to those moments na lang. Grabe kasi yung pinagdadaanan ng character ko dito, so I really don't have very fun scenes. But I really enjoyed the retreat, yung magkasama kaming lahat, and we got to film that scene together. And yung para naman sa challenge, yung pag po talaga, that's something I'm working to heal and change about myself to be a crier. Ako siguro po yung pag-protect ko kay Isa sa bullying. I mean, I know I didn't stand up for her in front of Mads, pero yung ganun po na I protect people from bullies, parang I always hated that people who take advantage of the vulnerable. I can relate to her in that sense.
we read the script, understand the character through the workshops po na mas naintindihan namin and got to a really deep level. And then also to build that chemistry together, we had sessions na magkaharap kami and just ask questions, some non-verbal and verbal um, practices. And yeah, yun po. through that, we were able to build a really great connection. And I think that shows on camera. <laughs>